I think <coughs> I think Ahsoka is about to get really weird, dude. You think so? Yeah. Yeah, I have actually a really crazy theory if you want to hear it. I want to hear it, yeah. But no spoilers. I want to keep spoiler free. Yeah, we can keep spoiler free because there's a whole nother thing that's a spoiler thing that I've been talking about. But this one is not a spoiler. Um, I actually think it's possible that Ahsoka will die in the next episode. What? Yeah, I do. I think she might die. And I have some right. really crazy. I, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. But do you know? Do you know that she's died before? Well, I guess with Vader. Well, on Mortis. Yeah. She dies. Right. And the Mortis gods bring her back to life. Wow. Well, like she kind of sacrifices herself. The well, the sister, right? Yeah. Yeah. So the she's a Mortis god, though, right? She's one of them. Yeah. I mean, I guess if you look at yeah. it like that, it's kind of a good so, theory. So I think, because like here's here's where the theory gets really wild. I think some of the rumored stuff we've heard about for episodes, you know, five and some of the later stuff, I think that could be in the world between worlds and that something to do with Ahsoka, because Ahsoka has this really weird trajectory where she goes to Mortis and dies, is brought back to life, right? And then she has the, what's the Mariah, what's that thing? The, the little Mariah. owl? The yeah, so she has that. Like, it's like a spiritual yeah. kind of thing that follows her around. It's there when she gets pulled through the world between worlds on Malachor 5. And, you know, we've seen that thing in Mando, too. And, you know, that scene, Ahsoka comes to get Sabine, um, and it's just like the end of Rebels? Yes. So what if Ahsoka, this would, by the way, this would be so crazy. Like, I don't know if they're going to go this far, but this would be my favorite thing. Is if, what if she dies in this episode? She goes to the world between worlds and she's brought back kind of like gandalf the white after going through this big thing where she like learns all this stuff and like changes right because i think she's supposed to learn about destiny so what if dude and this would be so nuts but i would love it if ahsoka gets a redo what if the next episode episode four is a bloodbath and ahsoka dies but again she goes back into the world between worlds and pops out literally back in time and sort of redoes the beginning parts of the season what do you think uh be mindful of your thoughts anakin they betray you i don't know about that man that seems a little too far-fetched for me i don't think it seems I, I pretty well yeah. kind of weird if she if ahsoka literally dies and then gets brought back to like like yeah yeah <laughs> dude no but here's the thing it's about to get weird either way I don't know, like chat, what we're, you think about this? we're about to do i think it's about to get super weird super weird and this could be a way that they get there i don't i can't watch anymore <laughs> i don't know bro that would, that's just yeah, weird like wild, i'm right? really liking the show i don't know about her dying like it's that's <laughs> if you're how else be do like, we think well, let me ask you a question. How else do you think she gets into the world between worlds? Um, I don't know. She opens up like a portal or something. Possibly. Like she, yeah. she finds the door. Maybe she opens up a portal. Maybe it's Morai possible. helps her. I've thought that, and this could be the way they do it, is if they go into the new beyond and they get to the uh, Chimera, right? Technically, I think the Lothal temple is still on the Chimera. It's destroyed, like Ezra, like crushed and brings it all down, but it's still there. Yeah. Um, and what if the like Night Sisters or whatever bring it, you know, resurrected and like make it back? And then, yeah, maybe Ahsoka could get in to the world between worlds. Um, Possibly. But what if it's like, because like, think about this, dude, like, this is what I keep coming back to is all this Gandalf stuff that Dave's been teasing out with Ahsoka for so long. Yeah, which is weird. Yeah, it's super weird. And like, Gandalf literally dies. I mean, he goes like down and fights the Balrog yeah. and like goes through dimensions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, dies. and then right. literally it's like essentially like the light. It's almost like the light side of the force, or whatever, just literally like brings his ass back because the light side of the force or in, I guess, Tolkien and nerd of the rings would know better. You know what I mean? It'd be cool to get his take on this. But, I, but uh, the way I understand it is like he's brought back because the balance has to happen. Sauron is so evil and so horrible that like without gandalf to balance that out it's just that's that's not cosmic balance so that's like he just literally comes back to do that 
So what if, so let me just ask you, let me just ask you this chat. Yeah. People are really triggered. So let me ask you this. What would you say? And, and also what are y'all going to say if she does die tomorrow? That's what I want to know. What are y'all going to say if the episode ends with Ahsoka being killed tomorrow? What are you going to say then? I mean, I'm going to say like, what the hell? Like that makes no sense. And yet the signs were there. <laughs> well, who kills her though? Is the question like like Dude, how is Balin. she gonna, like Balin or Morgan, but probably Balin. Okay, so she okay, so she kills the HK droids, obviously. Mm -hmm. All right, mm -hmm. then she goes and meets Balin. She's probably gonna ice our boy first. Well, no, but then we we in the trailers we have her and Maroc fighting and Sabine and in the forest in the, though in the forest. Right, she fights Balin at the map. Yeah, she so, fights Maroc so she in the to, forest. So we have three fights next episode. Dude, I think next, like I said, I think next week or tomorrow, I guess, could be a bloodbath, dude. 